The Defender Safety System was designed with maintenance free in mind. Uh, really shouldn't have to get in there and clean the combustion chamber, but you never know your installation, the variables, be it a dirt floor basement, uh, could be a workshop in a garage, um, things of that nature that may warrant, get in there and clean it out. And we do that down in the combustion chamber on the bottom of the heater. So to take the, the front door to gain access to the combustion chamber, first we, safety first, make sure your gas is off, things are cooled down. Quarter inch screws we're going to take. There's actually four screws in total that we're taking off here. I've got a couple of them already done. Um, take the four screws, set them aside. We're going to open this combustion chamber and most cases you're going to be able to take just the one side loose, set it aside. And the process here is the, the lint, dust, oil, that's going to collect on the bottom side of the screen. So we have a screen here, the lint, dust, oil is going to collect on the bottom using a compressed air source, be it nitrogen, zero gas, something like that. Uh, maybe even put it in a little wand or a, a, a tip on there. Positive pressure blowing into this chamber. We're going to work to get those louvers, almost like that screen is almost like a louvered system, get it clean. But be mindful as you're blowing that compressed air in, out of these bottom louvers and even on the side here, you're going to have that lint, dirt, dust, that sort of thing flying out at you. So wearing safety glasses, maybe a mask, and even having a shop vac or some vacuum source to collect that debris as it's coming out at you. Uh, clean it up, get it as clean as you can, button it back together, and you should be back in business.